Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to be going into Target and Joann's. And I want you guys to stick around until the end because when we go into Joann's, you are going to be amazed. At least I was. I have not been to Joann's in quite some time and they had just an amazing selection of things. So stick around to the end for that. And if you have not subscribed to my channel, go ahead and do so. Here at my Target, it was just a little bit picked over, but I am trying to show you guys everything that they have in stock. They do have a great selection of pillows and throw blankets and just a few wreaths and things like that. But they did have a great selection of pillows and throws. I really liked this collection that Target had this year. They have a wreath, a little floral arrangement, and then also a garland, and they all go together. So you could get one of each and put them in different rooms just to make a cohesive look or all in the same room. It would look really nice. And now moving on to the threshold fall line. Like I said, a lot of the things were picked over, but they do have a great selection of pillows. All of these with these pumpkins, they are gorgeous. And they range from $15 to In my opinion, Target always ranks number one in their throw section. They have gorgeous throws this fall season, that rust color and the browns. They also have some creams and those pretty fleece ones are just gorgeous. They all range from 20 to $40. This Randolph bench in the Studio McGee line is $180 and it would look fantastic in an entryway or at the end of a bed. Target had a great selection of candles this year as well. I actually have pumpkin woods burning in my entryway right now. It smells fantastic. We don't need no more Even in the hard times You and I can weather any storm Before I sleep Hear the cricket, see the moon Side by side Now moving on to the hearth and hand section they did not have a ton of stock, and unfortunately, my local Target, their hearth and hand section is really, really small. I see some other Targets that just have these huge hearth and hand sections, and that is not ours. It's literally like two rows. So unfortunately, there's not a whole lot of stuff, but I am showing you what they have for fall and just a couple of other things that could go for fall or any time of the year. That tray is gorgeous, and I think the price is just absolutely great it's such a versatile piece and it can be used for any season and for many many reasons 
I have my eye on this baking dish. I actually have the Dutch oven in the hearth and hand line and it is wonderful. I think Hearth and Hand nailed it with this pumpkin carving kit at just $20. I do feel like this is something that could be handed down for generations to come. Target had such cute disposable napkins this year for the fall season and these adorable little pumpkin canisters. They would be so cute for your sugar or candy, just different things like that. Super cute at a great price. This just about does it for the Target fall shop with me and we are about to head into Joann's. This was the grand opening weekend at the new Joann's in my town and it was packed to the max. I'm going to give you guys just a little glimpse of how loud it was in this store. Yeah, it was super packed, but I was trying to avoid people and let them shop and look in peace as I filmed. Joann's had such a great selection of wreaths, and I'm just going to show you guys just a few things that they have here. They had a great line of artwork as well. I was very impressed with Joann's this year and I honestly haven't been here in quite some time. I used to go all the time when my kids were little and I would make blankets and hair bows and things like that for my daughter, but I haven't been in quite some time, but I was very impressed with the quality of their pieces here at Joann. This bloom room section of Joanne was absolutely gorgeous. I feel like I could just go crazy in here with all the beautiful floral picks. As you see, this Joanne that day, they were doing 60% off doorbusters. As you see, there are four picks for $5. You really cannot beat those prices. That is not an everyday deal. That was because this was the grand opening weekend, but some really, really great prices regardless. And most of the time they do sales as well. Just some absolutely gorgeous picks at a really great price. Now moving on into some fall decor. These little centerpieces are super cute, but I do feel like the ones at Walmart are very comparable to these. 
These were $16.99. Of course, they, they were 60% off that day, but the ones at Walmart, I believe were about $5 and they're so comparable in size and in quality. I have seen so much wildlife at different stores this year for the fall season. These were very, very cute. Also comparable to the ones at Walmart, you guys. I just cannot brag on Walmart enough this year in their fall decor section. They had some great pieces. I'm afraid that they're probably super picked over at this point, but Joann's does have a lot of selection in the wildlife area if that is something that you're into. I'm not sure about you guys, but this wall makes me want to learn how to knit. So beautiful with so many colors, so many options. I'm sure that all of you out there that knit are absolutely obsessed with this wall. Now this is some Halloween decor that I could get on board with. It was so beautiful, you guys. And in person, it's even more stunning. Such pretty detail. And if you guys are into Halloween, I suggest you get over to Joanne. Some of the prices are a little bit pricey, but I would wait for a sale and snatch some of these things up. Such pretty detail and just some high-end looking Halloween decor. So pretty. I'm already thinking of a DIY for these moss pumpkins. You could get some at Dollar Tree or Walmart, Hobby Lobby at a cheap price, and then just cover them with moss and some of that twine. I think it would be a super easy DIY and it would just elevate your Halloween decor and make it look a little bit spooky. I know that I've said before that we don't do Halloween and we, we technically don't decorate for Halloween. We have always let our kids dress up and we, we do fun things for Halloween. We have for years and years had a spooky hayride. That started way back when my brother-in-law and my husband, when they were all kids, well, let's say teenagers, my in-laws, they would have a spooky hayride for the kids and they would invite all their friends over. And so we have also carried on that tradition. We have had, I think four or five spooky hayrides over the years with our kids. And my two younger ones have not got to have one yet. So they are begging for one this year. So we're strongly considering it. And so I am gonna have to go back to Joanne and get some of these items, especially those plates. I think that would be super cute for all the little party favors.
And now on to more classic Halloween decor. They had quite a bit to choose from here at Joanne. Super cute things at great prices. These huge porch pumpkins are so gorgeous, pretty pricey, but they would last forever if they are well taken care of. Now we're just moving into some more traditional fall decor and Joann's had such beautiful things. I love their doormats, their coffee cups. They have a really great selection of paper products like your paper plates and napkins, things like that. Such beautiful artwork. Just some gorgeous pieces here at Joann's this year for this fall season. I'm gonna let you guys just watch and enjoy the rest of this fall decor. I met an old man I said, tell me your story He took out an old pen And wrote something for me Walking on down the road And I watched him disappear like smoke And I thought I'd just seen a ghost Then I looked down at what he wrote He said, son, when you grow up you'll be fine now you've got questions on your mind Life is gonna happen one way or the other Whether you like it or not Stop looking for the answers And you'll find what you've got Just one more thing that I want you guys to be aware of while you're watching. If you will notice, all of these coffee cups have a different kind of logo and theme going on. They also have different dish towels and artwork and pieces that go along with all of these coffee cups. It's such a great idea. It makes your home feel cohesive and all of the decor 
And if you would like to just get a few pieces to add to your kitchen decor, it would be such a beautiful statement. So just continue watching and see if you can remember the different styles that go with the different dish towels and artwork. It was kind of a fun surprise when I came around to the artwork side and noticed, oh my goodness, that goes with that one coffee cup. I just think it was a great idea on their part and it's super cute. Well, that just about wraps up our Joann's tour of their fall decor, but I think I love fall most of all. That pretty much sums it up for me. Such beautiful things, such beautiful decor. If you have a Joann's locally, I suggest you get there and check out their fall decor. If you guys have not subscribed to my channel, go ahead and hit that subscribe button before you leave. And I hope that you all have a wonderful week and God bless you all.